briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a gripping 1992 legal case held in the Superior Court of Pennsylvania, the notion that skipping on a legal duty can lead to criminal liability was challenged. The case at the center was known as Commonwealth v. Pestinicus and dealt with the deliberate neglect of an elderly man. The defendants, a married couple named Walter and Helen Pestinicus, found themselves standing accused of third-degree murder. Their neglect in providing proper care for a 92-year-old man in their charge had resulted in his tragic death from starvation and dehydration. They asserted that they were limited to their contracted responsibilities, obscuring their moral obligation. However, the court came to the decision that criminal liability revolves around a legal duty to act, which itself can be established by a contract. The court determined that the Pestinicuses had willingly taken on this legal responsibility, sidelining the victim's family and failing to ensure his survival, sharply rebuking the defendant's argument. Evidence that surfaced during the proceedings demonstrated the defendant's calculated approach to deny food and medical care to the victim. Furthermore, their attempts to escape justice were brought to light with revelations of exerted political influence. These actions, interpreted by the court as clear signs of guilt, undercut the defendant's claims of misdirection from the trial court. Ruling on these revelations, the court found that the Pestinicus's failure to fulfill their legal obligation resulted in the horrific death of the victim. The court accommodated testimonies of evasion attempts and withheld alliances into the evidence, shining a light on the defendant's consciousness of guilt. Despite divided opinions, the court upheld the sentencing judgments, establishing a disturbing precedent for cases bearing similitude. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lsd.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.